My question to both of you is, regardless of the current rhetoric, would either of you name one positive thing that you respect in one another? I think that's a, a very fair and important question. Look, I respect his children. His children are incredibly able and devoted, and I think that says a lot about Donald. She's a fighter. I disagree with much of what she's fighting for. I do disagree with her judgment in many cases. But she does fight hard, and she doesn't quit, and she doesn't give up, and I consider that to be a very good trait. Well, it may have taken 90 minutes, but finally Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton said something nice about each other. They were asked that question. It was a rare moment, but it was brought to us by Carl Becker. He's an audience member who was granted the last question in the debate. And Carl Becker joins us now from St. Louis. Carl, thanks so much for your time. Thank you for your time and having me, Tamron. Absolutely. So you went in undecided, right? Went in undecided, came out undecided. Wow. So 90 minutes in, second debate, and nothing changed your mind. What, what do you, why do you believe you are in the middle here, or undecided, I should say? Well, we collectively have a, as a country have put forth two candidates that we just can't seem to figure out which one can lead us in the right way. And that's an individual's opinion. I just have been unable to figure out which one of those two candidates has the leadership qualities that will take us through the next four or even eight years. What made you decide to ask the question uh, that, that you posed to both of them? Well, I ran it by my kids. Um, just to throw it out to them to get their opinion. My daughter is 18 and she's voting in her first election and my son will not vote, he's 15. But I asked my kids, Shane and Darcy, what, what they thought of the question and at first they didn't like it, it was too broad to them. But <laughs> as they began to understand it better, they kind of gave me the thumbs up and I, I went with that question. Uh, along with another question, but that was ultimately the question that I asked last night. What did you end. think of the answer, and what did they say to you after the debate? Um, the answers were were pretty good on on both parts mm -hmm. for me surprising them, which wasn't my intent. It was to bring some civility to a a campaign that has been full of mudslinging. Again, my opinion, yeah. and. Afterwards, they were both very gracious. They're, they're very nice people. Uh, you know, perhaps they've, they've done something, you know, one side says the other has done something and vice versa. Well, you know, you got your moment. You were trending last night, Carl Becker for president. So given that you're not happy with both of the uh, candidates, maybe we'll see you on the debate stage in some future form. Never know. Perhaps you'll be my running mate, Tamara. Oh, I've too many things in my past. Thank you very much, Carl. I greatly appreciate it. And congratulations to your kids for um, helping you with that question. It's very awesome. And the beautiful city of St. Louis, thank you so much for accommodating us yesterday. Thanks, Carl. Thank you as well. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.